Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to my channel. In this video, I have for you a very, very easy solo money glitch. It is 100% solo, you don't need to join anybody, and you can make millions and millions of dollars once again in Grand Theft Auto Online, okay? So, as you guys know, as soon as I hit 15,000 subscribers, I will give Red Dead Redemption 2 or $100 to one lucky subscriber. So if you want to be part of this awesome giveaway, you simply want to subscribe to my channel, turn the post notifications on, then to be eligible you also need to drop a comment, something like, I would like to be part of the giveaway, and ultimately don't forget to drop a like, so please drop a like right about now. And if you are already a subscriber on my channel, don't forget to drop a like as well, it helps the channel to grow. And ultimately, don't forget to drop a comment, something related to the video, in order to get an additional chance to win once again, okay? So to do this glitch, guys, you need to have the mobile operation center with personal vehicle storage in Bay 3, okay? And you also need to have a facility okay so once you got all that you're ready to go okay uh, make sure you have the car you want to duplicate stored in the back of your MOC and then you want to make your way to any clothing store so from so from here you simply want to purchase any scuba outfit if you already have a scuba outfit just put it on okay and I can hear you from here guys not the scuba glitch okay but this time it is much faster it is super easy and then i will show you guys exactly how it works hopefully you will be able to hit this glitch your very first try okay so now guys it is very important make sure you register as a ceo and then you can go to the beach or to this area on the map because now you need to go in the water with the uh, scuba outfit but before you go in the water you need to open your interaction menu scroll down to style and then you want to hover over any outfit you have then you want to walk in the water and you want to press a as soon as your character put on the scuba mask if you do everything correctly basically you will still have uh, the scuba outfit on at this point so once you're outside of the water just open your interaction menu click on CEO go to management go to style and then you want to go once to the right and then once to the left to duplicate your air tank and if you're able to duplicate the air tank at this point you can now go to your bunker by the way you don't need to do this part with the scuba outfit over and over again you just need to do this part once and even if you turn uh, turn off your xbox and the day after you go back on grand theft auto online you know uh, you will still have the outfit okay so you don't need to do this part again just make sure to not switch to another outfit okay if i switch my outfit to another outfit i have i will lose the outfit so from here I need to drive the EC out of my mobile operation center. And now it is quite simple, you want to leave the car inside the bunker. And at some point in this video you'll see guys, the plate will change on the vehicle. The plate will change right in front of your eyes, so you can trust this glitch is 100% legit. Like all the other money glitches and exploits I uploaded. But now, once you're outside, guys, you need to make your way to your facility. If your facility is very close from your bunker, just like me, you know, um, you're good to go, okay? You can duplicate few cars, like, in a couple of minutes, okay? From here, it's very, very fast, guys, so get inside your facility, and I will give you tips and tricks to make this glitch faster, easier than ever, okay? So once you're inside, guys... Always remember you can use the blue circle, uh, this blue circle, there we go, to manage your vehicles, okay? So make sure you have your Faggio in the first slot, it's gonna help you to push the Faggio with ease. And to do this glitch you can use this bench if you want, okay? 
or this one on the other side. Now the idea is to push the Fagio to this bench or to the couch, you know. Um, but yeah, from here guys, you need to open your interaction menu, go to CEO, go to management, go to style, and go once to the right and then once to the left. You can do this part very fast and you'll see guys, and in the facility it is pretty easy to push the Fagio. You'll see the Fagio will glide uh, in the facility like crazy, so it takes about like 3 to 4 minutes, you know, to push the Fagio to this bench and you'll see it is pretty easy make sure to push the Fagio just like me okay and make sure you push the Fagio you know in a certain direction okay uh, make sure it is always parallel with uh, the bench ultimately okay and as you can see now I am pretty close from this specific bench now I still need to push the Fagio um, against the edge of this um, white triangle, okay? So if this happens to you, if your Fagio falls on the ground, just get on your Fagio and then you want to start to push the Fagio again. There we go. And the idea here is not to knock the Fagio down, okay? Uh, really the idea here is to be able to teleport on the Fagio, okay? So now as you can see the Fagio is against the edge of this uh, rectangle, there we go. So now from here guys there's a lot of air tanks. Make sure you always look at the air tanks, okay? Because you don't want them to despawn. Then you want to go to your Fagio and do just like me, press Y and if you teleport on the Fagio, you are good to go and you can move on with the next step. Now you need to wait until you have the right D-pad option to the left of the screen. There we go, I have the right D-pad. So now that you have the right D-pad option to sit down, you want to press Y. And then you want to press right D-pad and gas, okay? But you need to do this extremely fast. So the way you really need to do it, you need to press Y, right D-pad, right after, okay? Right after you press Y, you need to press right D-pad and gas. And you don't want to wait until you see your character on the Fagio to press gas. You really want to press right D-pad, Y, gas, okay? So I'm about to show you guys exactly how to do it. And this part will be in slow motion, but like I said, you need to do this part very fast. So press Y, right D-pad and gas, and hopefully you will spawn outside on foot, okay? If it is the case, you simply want to take your chopper, go to your bunker, and move on with the next steps. But if you spawn outside with the Fagio, you need to start the glitch over again, which means you need to go to your bunker, you need to pull the car out of your MOC and go back to your facility. Okay, so as you can see, I did everything correctly, so I simply want to go inside my bunker, I want to get inside the car, and as you can see, the plate just switched. There we go, guys. So now I need to drive somewhat closer to my... Uh, MOC, there we go. Now it's time to get inside my MOC. You'll see your personal vehicle storage will be empty at this point. It is normal. This is how the glitch works. So just exit the trailer and get back in your vehicle. Then you want to drive to your MOC and then you want to press right on the D-pad to store the vehicle inside your mobile operation center. It's gonna tell you personal vehicle storage is full, okay? So just go ahead and accept this alert screen and boom, you are done with this glitch, okay? You just successfully duplicated your car. Uh, now you have this EC in your MOC and the other EC is now in your facility. So now what you need to do to rinse and repeat this glitch, it's pretty simple. You want to drive the car out of your bunker, you go to your facility, you do the thing with the scuba tanks, you know, and then you do the thing with the Fagio close from the bench. 
and boom you will be able to duplicate cars like crazy guys if your facility is very far away from your bunker i recommend you to duplicate only a couple of cars with this method then you want to purchase a facility which is closer to your bunker or a nightclub because yes this glitch works with the nightclub as well as you can see in the background i just switched um my faggio in the right slot you know it's gonna be much faster is the faggio is closer from this bench so from here guys i need to do the same thing like i said you push the faggio and you do the, the trick uh close to the bench so as you can see i am so as you can see everything is good I'm about to do the glitch again, but something can happen wrong with this glitch. So I'm about to show you guys. I tried the glitch, it didn't work, okay? And I tried again, and it didn't work, okay? And it's quite simple. It's simply because I was not um, pressing right D-pad fast enough, okay? You really need to press Y, right D-pad, right after, and gas, okay? You need to do it extremely fast. But once you have the timing, it is a pretty nice glitch. You can make millions of dollars again in Grand Theft Auto Online. So yes, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If it is the case, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to my channel, turn the post notifications on. Thanks for watching guys and see you in the next video.